It's an issue of intolerance. It's an issue of extremism on all parties. I believe every Ustaz makes mistakes without exception. Take the good from all of them and leave the bad. When someone preaches hatred against another, discount it. And if you have the opportunity, go to them and tell them, please don't talk about other people. Those who talk about others don't have something to present themselves. I'm busy doing my work. So many people send me messages. Oh, someone called you a Wahhabi. Someone called you a Sufi. Someone said you're a Salafi. Someone said you're a Deobandi. Someone said you're a Baralvi. Some of these names, I don't even know what they mean, to be honest with you. All these names for me, I say, hey, look, I know what I am. I'm a Muslim and I'm trying to spread a good message amongst all groups. Let me carry on doing my work. The minute I turn to fight them, I become a fighter. I cause a bigger problem. And now who's going to do this good work? Because my energy, like I said earlier, all the energies are now being utilized, waste of resources to do something where it's going to be less beneficial, in fact, destructive. So please do yourself a favor. When you hear labeling, you need to be more intelligent than the label. You need to rise above it and tell yourself whatever good is coming from this person, I will take it. Whatever bad is coming, I will discount it. We all are guilty of labeling others. This one is this. Let's, let's understand. It's qualities that make us or break us. Look, I'm sitting with people. I don't need to know what inclination he is or I am. I know I get along on common factors that are 9,999 compared to the one item that I might, I might find that I'm different with him in. Do you know? So this is why I say, let's not allow our nation to crumble based on this labeling that's going on. Take the good from everyone and leave that which is not good, no matter where it's from. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us ease and goodness. Jazakumullah khair.